Miraculous. Tales of Ladybug and Cat Noir. Stormy Weather. Marinette was busy babysitting a little girl named Manon. Manon, please, it's not finished. You're gonna ruin it. In the background, the TV was blaring on. <laughs> Welcome to the finals of our Kids Plus competition, where today, one lucky winner will be announced as our brand new Kids Plus weather girl. So let's welcome our fantastic finalists, Aurora Boreal and Mireille Kake. Who will be the lucky winner? Vote now! Just then, the doorbell rang. <laughs> It was Marinette's friend, Alia. She showed Marinette a picture on her phone. But then Marinette remembered something. As they were leaving, the TV began to announce the competition winner. This is the moment we've been waiting for! The viewers at home have made their decision, and the new Kids Plus Weather Girl is... Mireille! The winner was very excited, but the loser, Aurora, was very upset. I should have won. I had the talent, the star looks, everything, but she took everything away from me. It didn't take long for her negative energy to reach Hawk Moth's observatory. The vibrations are so strong, I can feel the imminent anger and sadness. The moment of weakness of my next victim. Such easy prey for my Akuma. A white butterfly landed in his hand and was immediately corrupted by his dark magic. Then it flew out the window in search of its victim. When she saw it, Aurora tried to defend herself with her parasol but the evil butterfly simply fused with it, akumatizing the parasol. Stormy weather, I am Hawk Moth. I give you the power to seek revenge on them as my weather girl. All you have to do is bring me the miraculous. Can you do that? Yes! That's my weather girl. Show the world who the best weather girl really is. Magnifico! Super! Come on now! I want to see a hunger in your eyes! Meanwhile, at the photo shoot in the park, the girls considered how to get Adrian's attention. Come on, we're gonna stroll over there real cool as if we just happened to be passing by. Then what? Then? I'll invite him out for a fruit smoothie at the end of the photo shoot! Then we'll get married! Live happily ever after in a beautiful house, have two kids, no three, and a dog! Let's just start with just happened to be passing by and see if we can get to that smoothie. <laughs> Unfortunately, Manon had different ideas. Marinette, I want to go on the merry-go-round! <laughs> Meanwhile, just across town, a crowd have gathered to meet their brand new weather girl. Right, but instead, right. someone else comes out to greet them. Where's Mireille? Ugh, I am Stormy Weather, the only weather girl who always gets the forecast right. For all of you who voted for me, Ray, I'd advise you to move indoors. It's going to get very blustery. She uses her weather powers to create a strong wind blowing the crowds away, and then flies off herself towards the park where the photographer is getting frustrated. No, no, we need some more energy, more romance. We need... Uh... A girl! He sees Alia sitting alone. <gasps> I need an extra to pose with Mr. Adrian. You don't want me. I, uh, I think I'm having an allergic reaction to this apple. I know that's the person you need. Hold that thought! She quickly runs to the merry-go-round. <gasps> they need an extra to pose with Adrian. What? Seriously? Go on. What are you waiting for? But what about my mom? Uh -huh. You take care of Prince Charming, and I'll take care of Miss Unicorn here. Marinette starts to run back towards Adrian just as Stormy Weather appears and freezes the whole merry-go-round in a block of ice with Alia and Manon still inside. Run! 
Marinette quickly hides out of sight and opens her purse. Time to transform! A small red creature flies out of it. The creature swirls and morphs, becoming an earring on Marinette's ear. A red eye mask with black spots appears on her face. The rest of her body shimmers with light as it wraps her in a red and black super suit. Finally, a matching yo-yo appears on her hip. She parkours her way back to the now ice-encased merry-go-round. I'll get you out of there! Everything's gonna be okay. Where is Marinette? She hasn't forgotten about you, Manon. How did you know my name? Uh, uh, Marinette told me! She's coming right back, okay? She runs off to deal with stormy weather. By now, Adrian has also noticed things aren't right. He sneaks away and finds Plague, another strange small creature. Plague, close out! Plague is absorbed into Adrian's ring. He motions with his hand, swiping on a black eye mask and cat ears. Next, lightning reveals his black suit. And finally, a belt-like tail jets out from behind him. Cat Noir is ready. Ladybug and Cat Noir battle Stormy Weather, but all their attacks are thwarted by her various weather powers. Her hurricane attack is so powerful even the parked cars are sent flying. Ladybug and Cat Noir are forced to dodge cars, trucks and even a bus as they rain from the sky. Stormy Weather appears on a giant billboard screen beside Ladybug and Cat Noir. Hello, viewers! Here's the latest forecast for the first day of summer. Looks like Mother Nature had a change in plans. Summer vacation is officially over! Already? But I look so hmm. good in a swimsuit. Huh? <laughs> the cat suit will do, thanks. At least now we know where to find her. They quickly head over to the TV studio. Inside, they notice a cardboard cutout of a roar from the Weather Girl competition. Hey, that girl reminds me of someone. It's her. The Akuma must be in her parasol. <laughs> they bust into the film studio, but no one's there. It's a recording. <laughs> Suddenly, the power is shut down, leaving the heroes in complete darkness. Meanwhile, Alia is doing her best to comfort Manon as the ice slowly crushes the merry-go-round. As soon as she took a bite of the cursed potato, the poor princess fell into a deep, deep sleep. <gasps> Hurry up, Ladybug. Cat Noir leads Ladybug by the hand as he chases Stormy Weather from room to room. At last, they burst through a door leading outside and find themselves trapped on a rooftop of the TV studio, 50 stories up. <laughs> you airheads! You fell right into my trap! Stormy Weather surrounds the building in a swirling tornado. Ladybug has one more trick up her sleeves. She flings her yo-yo into the air and shouts, Lucky Charm! A magical item appears and falls into her arms. A bath towel? What am I supposed to do with this? Examining the surroundings, Ladybug comes up with a plan. See that sign over there? Check it out! All right! Hey, Coldilocks! Is that all you got? Cat Noir races off with Stormy firing everything she has at him. The distraction allows Ladybug to hurl her yo-yo at Stormy, wrapping it around her ankle. Cat uses his cataclysm claws to cut down a giant sign, causing it to topple over, falling on top of an air vent cover. It breaks off spectacularly, exposing a strong fan blowing air skywards. Still holding the other end of the yo-yo, Ladybug slides under a strong pipe before parkouring her way on top of the fan. She holds the bath towel open in both hands above her head and it inflates from the force of the fan, sending Ladybug flying straight up. The yo-yo cable is stretched tight from Ladybug down to the pipe and back up to Stormy's leg. As Ladybug goes up, Stormy is pulled down and the parasol is knocked out of her hand by a spinning crane. Ladybug floats down and catches the parasol. She breaks it across her knee. The black butterfly inside makes its escape, but not for long. No more evil doing for you, little Akuma. Opening the lid of her yo-yo, Ladybug flings it at the dark bug, capturing it inside. Time to de once the yo-yo returns, she opens it again. This time, a purified white butterfly emerges from inside. Bye-bye, little butterfly. And flies away. Miraculous Ladybug! 
She throws the bath towel into the air and the magic of the miraculous disperses across the sky and repairs all the damage that had been done by stormy weather including the ice covered merry-go-round. Someday your miraculous will be all mine. I don't care how many enemies I need to throw at you to win, but I will be victorious! Marinette made her way back to the merry-go-round. <laughs> I know what your secret is! What secret? Ladybug is your best friend! That's how you both always know what the other one's gonna do! <sighs> she approaches the photographers. I'm ready for the photo shoot! Wait, who is that? Angel! <laughs> the photographer said, looking toward Manon. <laughs> So Marinette missed out, and Manon got to be in the photos instead. Well, I hope you liked that. Thanks for watching, and you really should go watch Toylympics now. I think you'll like it. Here, click these links. Also, please subscribe. Yeah, we're a wannabe channel. See ya.